Hello, 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 my dear friends. Welcome to my channel. My name is Avilash and I'm the trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of GBP, JPY, British Pound, Japanese Yen for 2nd April 2021. So this analysis and video is for 2nd April only. You'll see me on Sunday again with the analysis for the coming week. So please do subscribe to my YouTube channel for regular market analysis. And I bring videos on daily basis and in advance so that you get to stay ahead of the market and you do not miss any opportunity. So please do subscribe and do check out the Forex analysis playlist for the analysis of other currency pairs. So let's jump to the chart. So as you can see right now the market is trading at 152.86. This is the current market price. Okay, And as you can see market came down and from here market made a v pattern okay in just the v pattern market reversed okay so to be very honest i was not expecting that after this fall okay after this fall i was not expecting that bulls will be so much in pressure and they will take the market upward like this okay, i did not expect this honest confession <laughs> anyways uh, right now we can see that uh, there was a resistance here okay there was a resistance here at sorry at 152.27 level okay there was a resistance but as you can see market broke the resistance and right now market is trading above the resistance okay so this resistance is no longer valid but but here market took support okay market took support at this level which means that the previous resistance is kind of acting as a support now okay so that's the game changer so previous resistance is acting as support now okay so this is all about the present chart now let's look at the weekly time frame so this is the weekly chart of british pound japanese yen and we can see that last week it has made a hammer kind of a pattern it has tested the daily support bulls came in took charge and ultimately it closed above the daily support made a hammer pattern whenever we see a hammer pattern it suggests that yes bulls are in power okay they they signify the dominance of the bulls and this week we have seen the dominance of the bulls okay this is the present candle okay just look at the present candle you can see that market has formed a pure green candle on the weekly chart so market is bullish on the weekly chart no doubt now let's switch to the overall chart overall picture overall picture what do you what do you see market is in clean up trend market wasn't clean up trend taking support at the 50 moving average this is just like a fairy tale <laughs> this market was just like a fairy tale okay we do not get to see a clean market like this okay this is a fairy tale after that market broke the support okay then market went side uh, dicey we got confused and again market has broke the previous resistances and market is in the uptrun again so market is very much bullish so we should only be looking for buying opportunity this thing is clear because we need to stay with the trend therefore we, we should not be looking for selling opportunity so what should be a strategy then okay the strategy is simple look for buy and where will you find the area of value in a market like this the area of value is very much important because without area value our risk to reward ratio will not match the area of value will always be near this near the support because this is this is an uptrend market so as of now uh, to find the best area of value and find the support what do we need to do we have we have to wait because see if you buy here okay if you buy here right now if you buy here where will you put the stop loss there is no particular position to put the stop loss okay so this is the against the discipline of a trader therefore wait okay wait for the market or wait for the stochastic rsi you can see that stochastic rsi is currently coming down so let the stochastic rsi come down okay let it come down and let it reach the oversold level this level when stochastic rsi will be in oversold level 
just observe the position of the price if you see that price is taking support at this level 152.27 152.27 27 if you see that price is taking support at this level this level and stochastic rsi is about to go up again okay just keep your eyes on uh, just keep your eyes on the stochastic rsi and the price if you see the stochastic rsi is about to move up okay and price is taking support at this level then it's well and good go for a buy at this support level plain and simple in case Stochastic RSI is about to go up and you find price in a position like this in between this 150 1.5 or this level above this around this level then you can avoid the price because there is no particular or good position to put the stop loss and that will be against your discipline okay you will be putting your capital at risk therefore as this Friday, uh, you should be very careful, okay, because this week is about to end. Therefore, let the stochastic RSI come down to the oversold zone. When it will be going up again, just look at the position of the price. If it is taking support at this level, okay, it should take support because the resistance has become the support now. So, if you see that it is taking support and about to bounce back from here, go for a buy at this level. So this is the analysis and strategy that you can follow for British Pound Japanese Yen for 2nd April. Hopefully you have understood and if you have liked the video and found the video informative, please give a thumbs up. And if you are watching my videos for the first time, please subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis. Thank you so much. All the best. See you on Sunday again. Bye-bye. Take care. And do not forget to subscribe.